And good evening, everybody. Hello and welcome. Uh, I assume everything's working okay? Yeah, um, I was going to do that, wasn't I? There we go. My name is Paul Grogan. Welcome to a live playthrough of Glenmore 2 Chronicles. Now, I did a live playthrough of this game last Friday, where we used the real game physical components all set up. Uh, tonight, we're going to be playing over Tabletopia, uh, just to show you that the game can be played multiple ways. And it is available on Tabletopia for free. You can play it for free on Tabletopia. Um, and that's what we're going to be doing tonight. Uh, now, I am not going to be playing on my own tonight. Uh, there is going to be a solo version of this game coming out when the Kickstarter launches for an expansion for this game, which is coming later this year uh, from Fun Tales. But tonight, I am joined by Monique and Naveen, all the way over in America. Say hello. Hello. Hi. Hi How are you doing? Hello. Great. Yeah, How are you? Yeah, Excited. good, good, good. Now, where, whereabouts are you in America? Uh, we're in a suburb of Los Angeles. Oh, right. So all the way over on the west west coast. All the way. Yeah, yeah okay. Yes. So eight yeah, hours difference, across I think. The pond. Yep, yep. It's about noon here. Cool. <laughs> cool. Uh, yeah, now, um, we, were, we were planning to do a stream together at some point anyway. We were talking about it about a month or so ago. Uh, and then I saw one of your tweets where you'd got Glenn Moore. And I thought, oh. I need to be playing more Glenmore at the moment, so that's that's how this happened. <laughs> so you've got a copy of the game and you've played it a few times yourselves. Yes, yes, definitely. And then and we played on Tabletopia on, as well. How are you getting on with the Chronicles? Have you played any of them? Just have we? No, only this one. This one. Only, only yeah, Chronicle only three. three. Okay, <laughs> you've played Chronicle three. You've not played any of this because I think I think when we spoke about it a couple of weeks ago. I advise you to play the base game first if you weren't familiar with Glenmore yes. 1. Yes. Mm -hmm. Right. That's what we did. Cool. And then we played the Chronicle 3 afterwards. Right. So you've played Chronicle 3. I haven't played Chronicle 3. Um, so oh. yes. So, <laughs> so Glenmore 2 is a game comes in a very big box. It's down there. Uh, and there are eight Chronicles in the game or nine if you've got the Kickstarter version. Um, you can play the base game without any of the Chronicles. Or you can add in one or more chronicles. They are all mutually compatible with each other. If you want to go crazy, you could add all eight in. Uh, although my, my brain would probably <laughs> explode if we did that. Um, now, we're going to be playing Chronicle 3 tonight. So whilst I'm not going to do a full tutorial of how to play Glenmore, because I've already done that on the channel, we are going to go over the differences for Glenmore uh, with Chronicle 3. So Clen Chronicle 3 is all about uh, whiskey. Um, and one of the things that's happened is in the stacks of tiles that you see here, all of the distilleries that were in these stacks, they've been taken out and they've been replaced by other distilleries. So the distilleries are still in the game. They just have a slightly different effect. Um, we each start the game with a cellar. And any time we get a whiskey barrel, we place it on the leftmost unoccupied space. Now, I read the rules before seeing the components. So... <laughs> left most <laughs> occupied space being is it that far left one there it's this one right here do you see what it's my that one okay yeah. it's this the, the one with the one, one victory point the one with the one it. on it okay so the first whiskey barrel you get goes there if you then get another <laughs> one you can put it on the next space and if you get another one you can put it on the next space uh and any more you get after that you can put on the zero space so there's no limit to how many exactly. you have but some abilities in the game allow you to right. age your whiskey which allows you to basically move the piece from one space to the next. The victory points below it, you only get them, I believe, when you sell the whiskey and you get a chance to sell it somewhere in the B, somewhere in the C, somewhere in the D. There is a tile which will come out and when our pieces pass that particular space, you get a chance to sell. Um, I think we can each sell one unit of whiskey, something like that, when we pass that tile. If there's space available. I think there's, a, in a three-player game, I think there's two spaces. So it's like the oh, first right. two people... The first two people pass to pass over it, it. Mm -hmm. will get to sell. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, and the other thing you can do in this game is that you can improve your seller. So over here, we have some extra sellers that you can buy on your turn. Uh, we have ones that cost one. Oh, no, these are the, are these the starting ones? It's got that whole on. stack is uh, the level two ones. And what's this one, then? Those are the excess that we're not using in a three-player game. Oh, right. Okay. So these are these are the level two ones. Ah, there we go. So the yeah. level two ones and there's mm -hmm. level three ones. 
And what you can do is you can buy them. So this one costs a coin, this one costs a coin, uh, and they can make your cellar bigger, which means you've got more room uh, so you can age the whiskey. And you can see here the points go up. But importantly, these are not the points that you will get at the end of the game for the whiskey. They, you only get those points if you sell it at one of those tiles. At the end of the game, the whiskey is just worth the normal amount of points. Um, and I think right. that's it. Is that the only changes? That's pretty much it. That's yeah. it. I think so. Mm -hmm. Right. Done. Okay. So we need to pick a start player. So you've got Schwazi. Yeah. So I'm gonna I'm gonna virtually yeah. put okay. my finger onto your phone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you wanna use your pinky? I will use my pinky. Okay. Paul is pink. Pink uh, pinky. Okay. Yeah. All right, that's Naveen. Naveen is Ooh. first. Okay, so you start with five Do you want to go for a second? Now, you're blue, aren't you? And then... Yeah. Uh, which means, Monique, you're going to have six coins, and I'm that means second. I'm going to have seven. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, thank you. So, just before we start playing, uh, I just wanted to say that this is not a sponsored video, okay? This is uh, one that I am doing as part of my Patreon campaign. Each month, my Patreon supporters vote on a game that I'm going to review. Uh, and this month they voted on the game for me to review being Glenmore. So therefore, because I'm doing a review of it, I want to play it lots in order to be able to do the review. Um, because I'm playing it, I might as well do a playthrough as well. But basically this video is funded purely through the support of my Patreon campaign. If you like the content that I make, obviously click the thumbs up on the video, leave a comment on there. Uh, but yeah, if, if you're able to, and any Patreon support, greatly appreciated to help grow the channel. Um... Uh, and also, Monique and Naveen are not just two random people that I know. They actually have their own YouTube channel as well. Do you want to give that a bit of a plug before we start? Uh, sure, thank you. Uh, we are from a channel called Before You Play on YouTube. We also do full uh, two-player playthroughs and reviews. So, yeah. Check, it, a, check it out. A lot, of, a lot of content. And you've been doing a Vital Lacerda series, haven't you? Yes. Yes, that's right. <laughs> We're... <laughs> It's been ongoing for a little bit yeah. longer than we had planned, but we're we just finished Lisboa and we have two more in the series to go. So right. if you're interested in Lacerda games. And we're going yeah. in chronological order. Yeah. From right. Creation. So you'll be covering Kanban in October ish? I yeah, I yeah, hope so. E V, so. yeah. 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 And we're probably gonna do Lisboa again with the new uh, Queen's yes. Queen's expansion. Yeah. Yeah. So, I saw Vittel was speaking to you about that on Twitter about it. Yeah. Okay, right. So, um, yeah, I'm just checking the chat. Hello to everybody in the chat for joining in. There's quite a few people here. Uh, Frodo is saying, Before You Play was the name of their channel. Yes, yes. Just Google it, uh, Before You Play, um, and, yeah, you should find it. Uh, mm -hmm. Right. So, we need to do the start. So, we need uh, a blue piece that can go anywhere. Yes. A yellow piece that can go... Oh, no, that's the wrong. What's that? Oh, okay. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> red piece there. Oh, We've shuffled the A tiles. We haven't shuffled the starting tiles, so let's do that. Uh, and off we go. Uh, that's neat. All right, let's we'll zoom in here. So, are you you're blue, right? I'm blue. Yeah. Wow. Well, I get first pick of the litter. This is exciting. Now we are playing with the third chronicle, which is whiskey heavy. Yes. <laughs> looking at that week right there. Cool. Yeah, pretty solid. I will try and keep a chat. Uh, Paul did indeed glitch. Okay, apparently I glitched. So hopefully I'm back on. Yeah, I mean, if you watched the live stream last Friday, we had nothing but issues. The stream cut out, the software crashed like three times midstream. We had all sorts of issues last oh. Friday. I have done some tests since then. And it's been okay. However, I have updated my Windows today and I have applied new graphics drivers. So who knows? Because if you don't apply the graphics drivers <laughs> and the software crashes, they say, well, you should have updated the graphics drivers. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. so Paul, can you uh, your, your cursor or your Those hand? updates. Let's see if you're still glitching. Yeah. Are you? Are I you? Uh, oh, your hand's not moving on my screen. Okay. Is your hand moving? I'm waving. In about nine seconds, light nine seconds time, it should come up. <laughs> worst worst case scenario, I'll pick all the tiles for you. Okay, that's that's, well, that's fine. Yeah, I mean, because then you get minus hey. loads of points at the end of the game. So, <laughs> <laughs> right. So, am I am I actually going out? That's the question. Oh, you're moving yeah, out. There you go, moving. 
Never ever updated. Okay, so I'm going to take now. this. If I just wave, yeah. That seems to be going out. I'll take this wheat tile since it is the third chronicle. Okay. Yeah. And I will move my little meeple there. And let's go ahead and place it right above my home castle. I'm going to grab you a wheat. Thank you. Let's orient this properly. There you go. What are what you going to do with rotation? that? Rotation? Is it is it Q and E to rotate? Yes, it is. Right. Okay. Uh, oh, is it? I just kind of right click and see what my my options are. So right. if you right click um, and there's that rotation little wheel, yeah, you can change it pretty much any orientation. Yeah, you can do it that way. Or the Q and the E keys are the hot keys for exactly. rotating. Perfect. Well. That's that, and then I am going to move, so I activate the uh, tile that's next to it, I get one movement point, so I'm going to move over to my castle. Aha! All right. Checkmate. Uh, I think I will go, you took the tile that I wanted, so. <laughs> New tile? Oh, yeah. There we go. Move that right there. And I, yeah, oh, I'm yellow. I'm in the business of, I think this is a cow, right? I'm going to put that right there. I get a cow. We're taking that tile. And here in this uh, software, I think the cows are all these uh, brown yeah, cubes. Uh, brown cubes, yes. Yeah. <laughs> You've been <laughs> but minimized to a cube. Sorry? But wood is orange. Oh, yes, wood so. is orange. So I'll do that, and then I'm going to move my person over, and that completes my okay. turn. You are done. Let's get a new A tile. Okay, right. So here's the, here's the thing. Do I... Do I take the stone and then get another go? Or <laughs> do I zoom ahead? So this ability here, this this is a new distillery tile. Uh, the ability is it comes with a whiskey. And then this is the new ability, which basically allows you to age one of your whiskies. Um, but that does come, uh, that does require wheat to buy. And I don't have any wheat. Um, but you can buy some from the market. Uh, everything is quite cheap at the market at the moment. But let's have well, a look. In, in a three-player setup, do we put one coin on the market? Uh, no, it's only two-player. Is that oh, only the two-player? Oh, okay, right. Um, I, oh, I think I think so. Let's check the rules. Where, did, yeah. where are the rules? Yeah. I had them downstairs. I was reading them. Here they are. Let's just check that. I read that, yes. Oh, it's two and three. Okay, so we need one coin in the market. Yeah. Good... Uh, Good, good early stuff. game catch there. I'm just glad Paul said something about things being cheap at the market. After the and that triggered your, <laughs> your memory. So that, that means me, uh, buying one at the moment costs two. Two. But yeah. I could yes. sell something for one. Yeah. Oh, let's have a look at what tiles we've got out. Okay. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna move to here and I'm gonna take this stone tile. Um, and. In order to do something different from you two, I'm going to put it below. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Just, is it snapping in place? It's not snapping in place. Right, okay. So that comes with a stone. Which is... <laughs> Where's the stone? Oh, the stone is black. Oh, sorry. I should have got oh, that's all right. I was, I was looking for grey, but there isn't any grey. Um, yeah, not grey. Yes. Okay. And I'm so, actually going to leave my no. worker where he is. So that's me done. Okay. And back to you. All right. So back to you. Yeah. Well, I got my eye on that. So I think I'm going to take the <laughs> wood production. Nice. Yeah, take, take this forest. Uh, that's going to go there. And then that generates me um, a wood, which is orange, and a stone, which is black. Yes. Okay, so that goes on there, that goes on there, and I've got one movement point, uh, and this time I think I am going to move it. Mm. So, oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, that's me done. I'll replace the tile. Perfect. And it well, is I'm not going too far. I'm going to go ahead and take this cattle. You're going to risk cattle, the, sheep. Your, the barrel tile getting taken? Yeah. By <laughs> me? It's going. <laughs> I want a diverse. Okay. 
economy here. And I feel a little bit strange. I went with a an early cow strategy. Mm -hmm. I've never done that before. So I get a wheat. Spoiler, if you watched last week's stream, or if you want to know what happened, I went with a cow and sheep trading strategy, uh, and I won by about 30 points. <laughs> it oh. was it was very close with everybody else. Everybody else was in one point of each other, and then I was like thirty points ahead or uh -oh. something crazy. Yeah, it just wow. all fell I'm right. I'm going to week. try to tap into that strategy. <laughs> Not quite sure. If I can leave the pull whiskey it up. for me and Paul. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, nobody else was doing it, and everybody kind of let me have the tiles, and yeah, it just all worked out really. Uh, well. Yeah. I will not be using my move for action. We need to move that to there, so we get another tile from the A stack. There we go. Okay. Okay. Uh, so it's me. I'm just going to go straight for yeah. the um, person. We have William Wallace here. So. I was going to say Martin side. Wallace then. <laughs> <laughs> Martin Wallace, yeah. Uh, and I get to put out one of my yeah. my markers on the clan fields. So, so we must start from the starting space. Mm -hmm. And I think what would be nice is some resources yeah. and a person. Kind of early game. So I'm going to go here, mm -hmm. and it'll grant me a person and a wheat. And a wheat. And that can go on any tile. Yes. Yeah. So I'm going to put... I was reading the rule book earlier on today, and there was this Douglas clan down here, and I didn't realize this, but anybody can take this any number of times. Oh. And it's three points. I don't think I need that. Oh, you can just straight up take that? three points? Well, yeah, I yeah, guess it's just was... like a... There, you can just do this. I was reading the list of clans. That's cool. Um, and it oh, is... Nice. Yeah, Clan Douglas. This clan can be taken multiple times and by different players immediately score three points. And I was like, oh, where's that on the board? And then oh. I saw it down there, so... <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah. I think that's it. I got my person right. and my wheat. It is it's now me. So, I didn't know, yeah. That's... Oh, we need the cards. That's what we need. Um, where are the cards for the A stack? Nope, not that one. Keep accidentally picking up the wrong thing. Are these the <laughs> A cards? It's hard to see. I think they're all in a bunch. So, I mean, we could just lay out all the cards like up here or something. That's probably uh, a good idea. Forward. Should we do that? Yeah, let's just take so the cards. So, you could pick it all. Um, I'm going to assume they're in order, but maybe they're not. Kind of like this. Just drop them. And then you can just kind of like look through them. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so that's what go. I'm going to do. I'm going to go around and I'm going to take uh, Castle Stalker. Nice. Now I have to spend a wood, a stone, and a cow to take that. So I'm just going to leave some resources nearby so I don't have to keep going to the banks. So there's the, there's the stone. Yeah, there's that's... the wood. I don't have the cow, so I will buy the cow from the market at a cost of... Do you need me to grab your cow? Two no, uh, he's no, just going to spend I'm, it. I'm buying it to spend it. Okay, I see. Um, right, because you can't buy it and keep it off to the side, right? right? Now, why did I move yeah, my cow? That was a really silly move. Mm. <laughs> oh, you're going to let me take that back? Because I was going to build Castle Stalker and I forgot it was a river. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Been Thank next, you. Uh, of course. Yeah, I, I just hadn't realized it was a river. In fact, is it a river? No, it's not uh, a river. Well, it doesn't have a river flowing through it, actually. No. Yeah. It looks like it has a river, but it doesn't. It's a mountain. Oh, it's not, yeah. Yeah, there you go. So we're fine. So that's going to go there. Uh, and then I'm going to trigger. Oh, well, first of all, I get Castle Stalker card, which was uh, this one. So that's mine, nice. and I get three money. One, two, need a straight money. That's nice. Three, um, and yeah, it also comes with a person who I believe starts on Castle Stalker. Yes. I then get a stone, and I've got three movement points. So that one's going to go there, and that one's going to go there, and we're good. So we get a replacement tile. There we go. Awesome. Right. All right. I am going to take this famous person. You're taking the person? I am. Yeah. <laughs> so if you are in the okay. chat, please let us know if you have played this game, how many Chronicles have played, which one's your favorite one, that kind of thing. Um, I know I asked this last time, I, I know it's a lot of similar people in the chat, but yeah, let me know again, because I've forgotten. So which one are you <laughs> going to go for? 
Let's see, I gotta zoom my way there. Okay. So Monique is in? here. So I can branch off of her. Yeah, or that's what's different with this game, is that you can branch off from where anybody is, rather than just your own people. You know, I'm gonna take this one up here, which mm -hmm. is a wheat and a whiskey. Oh man, yeah. I wanted that one. Yeah. Yes. Oh, Naveen, you go. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so you can put your whiskey on your... So we have um, our first yeah, whiskey so I'm, I'm in the cellar. My hand. I find that's the best way to transport it. And then there it goes. It goes into the one spot. There you go. See, it's and got really nice 3D whiskey technique. barrels. Yeah, it's It cool. does. It can even topple over, I learned. Yeah. All <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> like, get it right set up again. <laughs> and so this week, but... because I got it from that board, I can place it on anything. So I'm, I'm going to place it here. Yeah. Oh, my God. Okay. 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 And then this goes away, right? Because it goes, goes away. It's behind the yeah. last person. Yep. So Let's leave it here because I think so we need a running this card. Oh my gosh! I I always miscalculate scoring. I got a whiskey before scoring. <laughs> oh, it's scoring, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It's scoring wow. now. Wow. Yeah. Right. Okay. So the first thing Ooh, to check is in. people in the castle. Who has the least people in their castle? I have one. In. I have one. We all have one. Right. So nobody gets any points there. Next up is location cards. You have it, Paul. I have one. So I have one, zero. One yeah, point for me. Nice. Uh, and we call it there. That's a good game. Thank you very much for playing. <laughs> one zero. All I win with, with one point. Um, next up is whiskey barrels. Have one. So that's, I have zero. That's one point there. Not proud uh, of it. Next up is uh, people or characters or clans or whatever. I think you two I both won. get a point. Yes. Yeah on the map okay sorry Naveen I oh, gave you a victory you point I, I did I, I, yeah. yeah I'm, I'm so used to winning my hand. the game and having to move everything around myself I, <laughs> I <forgot laughs> that. Uh, Mark is yeah. in the chat said he's only played the base game but he's played it three times time to move on to one of the expansions oh. I think yeah, it, um, it is the base is just so good <laughs> yeah no yeah just so fun yeah Right, so that's it for scoring. So we're now into the B stack of tiles. And remember, somewhere in here is a tile which is going to allow us to sell our whiskey for points, if we have right. any whiskey. So, okay, so because you... I can't believe you didn't take this. I'm going to take this one. Yeah. The, it's going to cost me a wheat. Cost so you a wheat to take it. There. It's my wheat. And then I'm going to place it probably here. I don't know if that's the right thing to do, but it gets me a whiskey barrel. Yeah. So I now have a whiskey. Oh, it which you can then kind of age it's straight it. away. Which I can. Yes, you're right. It's yeah. now on my two spot, and uh, because I placed it there, I get another cow. Get a cow so, and two movement points. And two movement points. So I'm going to. Well. Maybe I should have taken that tile. It's, <laughs> really, yeah, I think you should have <laughs> taken the tile. Whatever you're doing. Um, I'm not going to move anybody right now. Okay. New and then I get to go again. You so do. I think the best thing to do yeah. would be to take this oh person. God. And it looks like we have Robert Stewart. And Robert's going to come join my other person right there. He's going to stand on top of Martin and Wallace. And now I can put <laughs> next to Martin Wallace. <laughs> and now I can put out a marker. Although Naveen took the spot that I wanted. Is there. You can't have it all, money. Something <laughs> else <laughs> that free well let's let's get more resources because they don't have really a good way of getting them right now so let's go here so i get yeah. a wood and, and a stone a stone so here's my stone. stone oh i got i got oh, the stone already okay. i'll get you the wood which is orange thank you not brown here you go i'll just drop it off halfway thank you all right and i believe that completes my turn okay so wow. another tile from the b stack ah right now this oh, is the time so this is a special tile. This isn't a tile that you take. This is just a tile that when your when your figure passes over it, at that point you can drop off a barrel. Uh, and as you say, in a in a three player game, there are two available spaces. Yeah. What's this, what's this circle in the top left? So door, then, if you so, land yeah. on the tile, then you have the optional ability to sell a second one, and you would sell it to that space. Oh, so that's the that. only way you can sell two in right. one. So that space is occupied 
then nobody, then nobody else, else can land can on it, it right yeah because yeah. just physically yeah. the way that the rondelle works yeah mm -hmm. okay right let's have a look what have we got here um okay well what have i got in the way of resources i have to have some stone i do have the money do i want to take that where's my people uh yeah i think we're going to take that we're going to just take the the first one which is nice. the town is of akfari oh i had lots of fun last week trying to pronounce these scottish names <laughs> <So long. laughs> i made a complete mess of it um so that comes with a person uh and then i get two movement points and a wood and another stone so i'll take that i'll take that and for the two movement points i think i'm just going to move uh oh let's move this one down to here oh yeah let's do that okay uh tile from the b stack and off we go now this is our first upgrade tile yes ah yes uh pintiles in the chat said just played for the first time last saturday cool presumably you just played the base game which is always good to start nice now, Monique, I see your finger is hovering over the tile. On oh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> that Michael was is really asking, coincidence. how similar is this to Clans of Caledonia? And the answers in the chat are not even remotely similar. And yes, yeah. although it's set in Scotland and there is whiskey. Yeah. <laughs> whiskey in Scotland. There's, yes. there's no similarity in terms of the game mechanisms at all. Yeah. All right, okay. Now, Paul, do we know what this done in Castle? What's we the do. benefit from, on the card over there? Uh, let's have a look it'll be over here uh, it is you get a clan okay get, yeah Perfect. it's the same as taking a person let's but it, it counts as a location card rather than a, a person tile so i'm gonna do it and it's gonna cost me dearly so it cost me wheat, <laughs> which i have uh stone and wood so it's gonna cost me four bucks Jeez. and money in the end of the game is points every so coin is a point four points. Cost me something. That's costing you points. Money, do you mind mm. just uh, being my banker and helping me out? Sure. Yeah, how much are you spending? Four dollars, okay. unfortunately. And here's the wheat to go with it. Two. Take, take it all. <laughs> take it all. <laughs> just take it all. And we're gonna... Are you? Wow. You spent four points for that. You know, <laughs> I I got jealous of Paul's card over there. <laughs> <laughs> the hard ones castle. with the yeah. hard ones. So, uh, so I will grab that card in a second. What's it called? It's the Donnan Castle. Okay. I just want to Let's make sure I, I don't find slow it down for you. Turn. Yeah, this so, is your card. So you spent yeah. the money to buy resources. Yeah, I spent the money to buy resources. Okay, so that and money then, should have um, actually gone on the resources. On the resources. Ah. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, so I didn't. I'll do it. What I, was it? I, Stone uh, and wood. Mistaken. It was uh, wood and stuff. Nice. Yeah. I, think so. yeah. I can <laughs> so go. Sorry. Ooh, I'm gonna go here. This gives me a sheep and a, a cow. Cow. Yeah. Cow. And remind me, neither of you to have played the first edition of this game, have you? Ooh, oh, oh you know what? Yeah, the first one. Skype was breaking up a uh -huh. bit there. Because in the first edition, of it the was game, <laughs> uh, money. It was a zero-sum game. There was no extra money in the game, other than. You, you bought and sold from the market and the money just moved around between the players and the market there was only one card in the game that actually gave you a couple of extra coins oh um, yeah so That's yeah very interesting different game. very different game. yeah very different money very different. was massively tight in the first first edition of the game wow and it was three rounds right is kind um, of what i remember oh i can't remember that i thought it was still four well you're right right it might be three. Oh, yeah yeah, this is very much a second oh. edition of the game rather than just like a reprint with a lick of paint. Okay, we have our new distillery that's Right, come right, out, we were wondering. Which is uh, Ben Wivis. So it doesn't come with any whiskey, but it does give you the ability every time you activate it to either age whiskey twice or um, convert two wheat into a whiskey. Oh, okay, great. Are you done with your turn, Nadine? Yes, that okay. was the end of that. I uh, feel like I'm a little bit uh, kind of going in deep here. 
So we're going to take this another, it's another a distillery tile. It is, yeah. It cost me a stone. So there's my stone. And I think that it would be beneficial to put it here. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to put it there and it gets me a whiskey. Yeah. So let's get this barrel of whiskey going on this spot right here. And then now it gives me the ability to turn in a wheat for another whiskey. Yeah. Which or I can move a whiskey small. barrel over. I don't have a wheat. And I think it would be cool to just move it over because that's pretty much the point of the chronicle. So let's just do it. Okay. And then I'm going to activate the tile next to it, which lets me move it over again. So I'm going to spend a yeah. coin to um, buy my next level seller. Uh -huh. so I can get the coin into nice. its bag. Okay. So, and I believe that's this one? Yes. Yeah, the so the next level seller goes four, five, six, eight, I think, nice. right? Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it jumps in. So I, I purchased my seller and let me just move it over. This hatches. And then okay. activating this tile will let me move this over to that next spot. Nice. And then now I can move a person, but I think, how many tiles are left in the B stack? Oh, there's a lot. Yeah, I'm going to okay. leave it. 15. I'm just going to let it. You're not going to get caught out yeah. by the scoring. <laughs> <laughs> I always do. That's like my downfall in this game. Okay. So hopefully this time. So my guy. Sorry, uh, going back to my turn, I was supposed to get a little guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, where? That That's comes fine. on my Donner Castle. Yeah. Just keep hanging out there. Okay. Yep. Okay, so yeah. let's Activate take, I think we're going to take Lock Locky. Because it's Ooh. got a funny name. I like that tile's name. Actually, lock locky. Yeah, lock locky. There we go. So that's going to go lock. there. Uh, so it comes with the lock locky card, which basically oh, yes. gets me any two resources that I want. Um, well, I'm gonna take nice. the wheat because everybody else has got wheat and I haven't, and I'm feeling left out. <laughs> um, and now let's have a look at what's coming out i'm going to take a cow now what mm. color are cows cows are brown aren't they they are brown yeah <laughs> things that you never <laughs> hear no. what color are cows um <laughs> so that's going to go on there as well uh i'm so that's that and i actually also get one movement point so i'm gonna move yeah i think i might move that one there and i get another wood let's take a wood mm. And put that on there so this guy's basically going on a rowboat around the lock on his own mm -hmm. oh it'll be fine romantic it's not, it's not <laughs> yeah okay next oh. tile comes out and it is right. is glen locky another distillery okay uh, <laughs> since it's my turn i have a lot of cattle in stock i'm going to take this tile right here oh i wanted that i get tile. to convert any two animals for four points yeah that's a great one so i'll take it Move it there. Uh, Young is in the chat. Uh, yeah, first time tuning in for a while. Thank you for joining in. Uh, how are you liking the game? Does it compare favorably to the original? So I will be doing a full review of this game later this month. But if you want a quick spoiler, am I liking the game? How am I liking the game? I really like the game. Does it compare favorably to the original? Yes, definitely. The original was a good game. This has taken it up a notch, and the changes that this game, that this version has brought in, I think is an improvement. Uh, and then we have lots of comments about um, Lock Locky being the Boaty McBoat face of Locks. <laughs> yes. Do you know the story of Boaty McBoat face? <laughs> Is that, has, has, that, has that news reached all the way to Los Angeles? I don't know anything about this. Right. So this is a no. thing from about yeah. three years ago. I think it was about, it was either two or three years ago. Um, and I can't, I can't remember the exact details. The chat will tell us. But basically, uh, a company in Britain was building a boat and it was going to be, I think, for scientific research or something like that. It might have even been government funded or whatever. And what they did is they put it to the to the nation to choose the name. OK. Uh -huh. And of course, oh. the nation voted and we chose Boaty McBoatface. Mm. <laughs> and it became this yes. this running joke, <laughs> that, you know, British humour. Um, so yeah, this has I mean, been going on for years now. Boaty McBoatface. It's just uh, yeah. That's beautiful. <laughs> it's quite funny. You're like you asked. It's like a momentous moment in yeah. history. Yeah. I love it. 
<laughs> okay, so uh, on my turn there, I turned in the two cattle to get the four points. That's you got four how, points? That's how this mysteriously Wow. So, suddenly you have so many points over there. But, yeah, that's what I was doing. Do. That's what I'm, also, I'm seeing that cows are worth two, and I'm short on money, so I'm going to sell my cow yeah. to take two bucks. Okay. Oh. So I'm, I'm using the market here. Yeah, I meant to sell my stuff. Goodbye, cow. I do that more too. Uh, Scott oh, is saying, wasn't it in the RNLI? Yes, it could have been the RNLI, actually. Uh, and Daryl's saying, if there was a promo <laughs> tile for this game called Boat Him at Boat Face, he'd buy it. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we get another tile from the Beast Arc. That's, uh, that's, um, I bet they could do that. Okay. 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 So, I'm going to go... I'm, oh, it's my turn, right? I'm yellow. Yeah. Okay. Let's go with this one. This is, I don't know, I think it's pronounced drum, drum, drum bag. Drum, but... drum bag, yeah. I think that's one of the easier yeah, ones to pronounce. <laughs> that's true. I am going to, ooh, I can oh, I didn't do myself good here. I think I only can maybe put it here. Yeah. Okay, let's just do that. The only place and then it's going to get me a person. Uh, it it and... was the British Antarctic Survey. There you go. How? <laughs> I get a cow for activating this tile, and then I can move my people. Oh my gosh. Oh no, we still have 10 tiles. Okay. So I need, <laughs> yeah, I'm really, Just really hyper aware of that. I actually have two movement points. So this here, and I'm going to move this here. Yeah. I think that's it. Okay. So we got rid of a couple of tiles, and oh. we need two more. Yeah. And it is me. Right, let's have a look at the situation. So if I go past this space, I don't actually have any whiskey. Um, so I wouldn't be I wouldn't be taking that space up. Uh, now this space here, Glakemore, that's an upgrade tile. So that goes over the top of an existing production tile. Um, it's specific to that, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so it's basically going to chop down my forest or my quarry and replace it with a field which produces wheat. Which is pretty cool, I think. <laughs> Leave it there. Yeah, well, the first thing I'm going to do is I am going to sell... <laughs> I'm going to sell a stone. Ah. There we go. Okay. Right. Ah, I keep forgetting the market is exist in existence. It it is there. So, yeah, if I <laughs> It is there. That, because uh, I don't want to take that one. There is another castle. We do like our castles. You do, um, <laughs> you do like your yeah, castles. Well, I'm British. I like my castles. But that's good because it doesn't seem like we... <laughs> <That's good. laughs> uh, oh, the other option is to take that. No, I'm going to take the upgrade. So I'm going to take this one. Mm. So I have passed this yeah. space. Uh, that cost me a wood. And then I am actually going to put it over this space here so the resources carry over nice and that one goes there so i get a coin for doing that there we go one coin and then i activate all of these buildings and i get uh the wood there i get my first wheat there's my wheat wow you have a lot of money i do <laughs> Um, yeah, so the wheat goes on there, and then I get one, two, three, four movement points. Hmm. Ooh. <laughs> uh, you have I a dance I'm, party with that. I, I could do. I th let's have a look at what I'm going <laughs> to buy next. Okay, I know what I'm going to buy next. So, yeah, I think I'm happy with where they are. Yeah, he all good. Yeah. Well, I might. Oh, no. I might. We'll see. Right, there we go. We have a new tile. Inverness. Which is another upgrade tile. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. This is me. All it right. is you? I, wood is very expensive. I have no money. I'm going to take this tile right here. It gives me two turns in a row. It does. So I will take that one. I'm going to put it right over here. Which. Paul, I'm going to steal that wood that you left over there. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, wait, so where'd you go? Oh, money sent it back at me. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> then I will. Yeah, I'm just going to leave a pile way. of resources here because they're easier to get. Oh. Yeah, thank you. So I got the wood. Okay. And that's going to activate the tile to its left, which is turn in any two animals. 
four yeah. points. I guess this is my game. <laughs> this is what I, yeah. You guys got the whiskey barrels. You're in the cattle. I have no I have no ability to age my barrels. Let's put it that way. Ah. Uh, so thank only you worth for one point. informing us of that. Thanks. Leave all the cattle <laughs> for me. Okay, so four points. And then you're gonna go again. I am. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Huh. Okay. All right, and I am gonna move because I do have one movement point. And, oh, let's just move myself right back onto the home castle because I feel like this is gonna wrap soon. You think so? Well, yeah, nine nine tiles left. Nine. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. I just want—I don't want to be caught. Oh, now you're making me nervous. <laughs> All my people—they're so spread out. Yeah. It's a meta game. Okay, so <laughs> this is gonna go here now. So that that wrapped up my turn. And then you get to go again. I do. Well, now with that newly acquired wood, I can take this, and then I do have the ability to mm -hmm. age. Interesting. Do I have a legal placement? I do. Okay, I'm gonna take this. Okay. Can you move my meeple if you don't sure. mind? Sure. Yeah. Um, Paul, do you know, so the tile that Naveen just took, yeah. it has two barrels, barrel movements. Yeah. Can you use it on the same barrel? Don't see why One not. barrel can move twice. Ah. Um, let's just check, see if there's anything in the rules that says otherwise. We looked it up and we couldn't see it. Yeah, we couldn't find it. No. It looks like, the way we played it was... You move a barrel, then you reassess your entire stock, and then yeah. you move a barrel. Let's let's play it that way. Neil's unfortunately okay. couldn't join okay. us tonight in the chat, but um, yeah, if anybody else knows otherwise, let us know. But otherwise, we're going to say that this is two okay. separate movements, and you can move the same barrel twice. So I will move okay. this barrel from uh, one, two, three. Yeah. Ooh. So. And I do have movement points, but I'm not going to use them. Okay. Mary Stewart has come out. Okay. Uh, before, and I can sell to the market before I take my turn, right? Like, that's the... I think so, because that, that's yep. what I did. Yeah. So, yeah, I think it's on your okay. turn. I'm going to sell this wood for two coins. Two coins. Mm, yeah. So, there goes the wood. There we go. Two coins. I can get you the coins as well. Well, I, I take it from the market. So I removed them from the market. Why did I do that? Oh, I need to buy. Um, oh, no, actually, I'm going to put them right back onto the market because I need to buy stone. So, wood so for that stone. I can take this tile. Yeah. yeah, wood for stone. There you go. Perfect. So I took this tile and I'm going to place it here, right there. Oh, and it's going to get me a whiskey barrel. Yeah. Oh, money bag. So let's keep. Whiskying. There you go. And then it allows me to turn in a wheat to get another whiskey barrel. I didn't plan for that. You buy wheat. But yeah, I think I'm going to have yeah. to. So here we go. I'm going to buy. <laughs> oh, there you go. Yeah. So, so I bought the wheat. wheat, but I'm turning it in yeah. just to have another whiskey barrel here. I'm putting that right there. And then okay. now, because I placed it there, I get one, two, Two, two whiskey, whiskey movements. barrel movements. Nice. So I'm just going to move the same one twice. Yeah. Let's get that up there. These tiles go bye bye, right? And that's uh, it. Oh, yeah. Now you two passed this. Did either of you want to sell a whiskey? No, I'm not going to. I wasn't going to sell. I'm not going to ah, sell it. Right. Interesting. Because when I passed it, I was only at value one. Oh, okay. Right. Okay. So this you're thinking of the phase B is going to end early. You may have been right. That's why this. I put those units back in. Right. And... Open. In it for the long game. <laughs> okay, right. Now then. <laughs> so yeah, I was going to take. I was going to take the castle. <laughs> yeah. um, that was. The plan. I was like, a lot changed since you said you were going to take that tile. <laughs> Let's have a look. Where is Duar Castle? Uh, there it is. Oh look, Ooh. it gets money. <laughs> All money bags over there. Yeah, I know. Paul, well, your money is. Leave big. the money. Woo, making I am me nervous. Take it, whether it's the right thing or not, I don't know, but I'm going to take it. So, 
we need to spend one wood, which is orange, one stone, which is black, and one cow, which is brown. Uh, we're going to take the castle and we're going to put it here. Okay, so what that comes with is a person on there. Um, and it comes with the card. Now, I did have the card a minute ago. Yep, there's the card. And the card comes with a coin, which I will take. Wow. And I get to take uh, one of the clans. So let's have a look where we want it to go. Because some of these other ones have unlocked. Um, now that, that there is two people, if I'm right. Let's just have a look. It is... Oh, then yeah. What's the name of the clan? Where's the, is there a zoom? No, oh, there is a zoom. Uh, if Ross. you press the space uh, No, I'm looking at the board. So oh, oh. The board. I don't think it zooms on the board. Yeah, immediately take two Scotsmen and place them on any tiles. I think I'm going to go with that one. So mm -hmm. I have to pay a coin to do that. But I take Ross. Um, so I pay a coin. There you go. And then I take two Scotsmen. I'm going to put them on there. Oh, okay. wow, you have and a lot of people. Too. Then with the three movement points that I've got, I'm actually going to move that to there. Oh, now, do I... Do I, do I, do I? Let's have a look what's going on here. Um, no, I think... Oh, gosh. Yeah, I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to pile him on as well. Oh, oh my yeah, god! Yeah. Well, you got it. Five points if you do it, you might as well. Somebody heard that we just had a new shipment of Jaffa cakes in at the castle, so uh, every everybody wishes. <laughs> there. Um, I think we're done. I took the card. I took the clan. I took the coin. I did my movement points. Yeah, that's that's it for me. You get your. Oh, it's just a bunch of movement. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's a whole bunch of movement. Right, new character has come out. Um, there we go. I'm blue. Okay. Okay. Oh. This so, over here is a big meta game. Yeah, looking, at Paul's, uh, looking at Paul's money and, money uh, and <laughs> people. <laughs> See, do you two think that I actually have sweating a sweating over here? Because I don't have any plan at all. <laughs> <laughs> just I'm just playing and doing stuff. <laughs> so much money, Paul. Yeah. Oh, man. I mean, there is a tile I know because somebody took it in the last game. Uh, here we go, Armadale Castle, which means your first eight coins are actually worth yeah. a point each. So, mm -hmm. obviously that's, that's pretty that nice. might be what I'm looking for. Yeah, what you have okay, so... This costs stone, which is three bucks now. Ooh, yes. That is too expensive, because Monique messed up the market. I did. Now I'm proud. I cannot leave this <laughs> in the <laughs> This is an overbuild, though. It is. It overbuilds still, onto a village. In the town. vicinity of it. Yeah, so I would be you, if yeah. I overbuilt next to one of my. So you would have to overbuild the same type of tile. Yep. Yes. And so then yeah, 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 that's legal. Yeah. But I realized I gave away all my cattle, which is the currency for it. So I'm gonna just move on ahead and get this person. <gasps> yes. Yeah, it's another clown. Okay. That's bad. That's pretty much all I can do, and it doesn't add to my uh, domain. Nope. Which is good. So, which one oh, would you yeah. like to take? Uh, let's take a look. Sorry, I have to scroll here. Okay, so you opened up some stuff for us. So, if I'm here, this is one, two. I'm here, one. This is one, two to David Hill. I'll do it again. He counts as two people, huh? Gosh. Okay, I will. I, I need money and people, so I'm gonna go here. I'm just gonna go cheapy. Cheapy, yeah. cheapy? Cheapy. Two bucks and a person. Okay. What are you going to do, Paul? Well, I think <laughs> I might take this one. <laughs> okay. Because, uh, because my river is a nice river. 
Uh, I'm going to put it there, and it comes with a you person. You have a beautiful river, Glenn. Yeah. Um, but there's nothing activates. Oh, well, I get a movement point. Um, so I think I'll move... I think I'll do that movement point. Oh, you can move diagonally, can't you? Yeah. You can move diagonally. Yeah, so I think I'll do that movement point there. Now, I took Lock Locky earlier on, and it came with two resources. I thought those resources were supposed to go on Lock Locky. And I think I put them on Castle Stalker. It doesn't make any Probably. difference. It probably, yeah, you can move them. Yeah, I, I don't think it matters yeah. at all. It doesn't, I don't think so either. Just because that tile doesn't produce, I don't think yeah. it will cause you a problem. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's me done. Okay. Uh, from the well, tile one. from the B-Stack, it's Loch Ridge. I think that I should take Inverness. But how much is that going to cost me? That's the question. Yeah, things are expensive. Uh, Oops. You don't have a ship. Okay. You do have a cow. No, I have to pay two for it. So I'm going to do it. I don't know. This might be. This might be my downfall if I don't get any more money. But <laughs> let's pay these two for the sheep. Two for the sheep. I think I. I'm placing it from afar, so let me know if I didn't place it I'll, properly. I'll it. I will give you a heads up that there is going to be scoring. This is the last tile yeah. that's coming up. And here's the cow. Yeah, that that was the goal in this, actually. So I turned in all my payment. I have yep. to overbuild. And so it it's going to overbuild on top here. of... Oh, that space. Because it's a river. So river, yeah, town, right. overbuild. There you go. And so it gives me a person mm -hmm. onto that tile. Yep. And, and it the gives Inverness me card. the... Inverness card. Oh, what does that do? Where's the Inverness? <laughs> oh, here. It gives me a wheat and a whiskey oh my God. barrel. Go. So I didn't want, I was feeling left out in the card game. <laughs> the very first so, move, you're like saying you're going to do cattle strategy, and all of a sudden you have five whiskey. Yeah, cows. I didn't do anything with the cattle. <laughs> it was a bluff. <laughs> I was like, well, I'll get some cattle. Yeah. Some whiskey. I saw I, some I, other I'm, opportunities. I'm not going to take any money in this game, okay? That's, that's <laughs> and then, uh, so because I placed that there, I can move, I get three movement points, I can move a barrel over, and I get a cow. So let's do the cow first. There's the cow. Oh, I got my cow back. Yeah. Okay. And then I am going to move this whiskey barrel over. Nice. And All then right. I have three movement points, so three movement points for people. let's get some people <laughs> home. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, taking away Paul's power. One, two, three. I'm going to leave that person there. Oh, I like it. Okay. And that's that's it. Scoring. So, scoring. so first of all, people in the castle, who has the least? I have three. I have three as well, so we're tied okay. for the least. So I have five, so I get two points. Yeah. So I'm going to take a three okay. and get rid of a one. Okay, next is cards. Who has the least? I have one. one. Card. Oh, we're tied okay. for the least. Yep, and I have three, so I get two points for my cards. Very that good. A, that was a killer turn, uh, money. Next is uh, whiskey barrels, but we'll we'll skip that. We won't bother with that. Uh, next <laughs> is <laughs> okay. So Who I has... have no whiskey barrels. I have one whiskey barrel. Okay, I have five. Oh, Moni gets eight points. So yeah, wow. That, well, brutal. I mean, this is the second time I'm earning points in, yeah. <laughs> in the game. Yeah, <laughs> I gotta but, catch up somehow. But you're you're so, creeping up with those whiskey barrels. Yeah, and you're about to sell one for eight. I assume at some point. Eight. Excellent. And characters. Oh, uh, I, I have, have two. no I have characters. Well. So you two both get two points. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. Um, so let's recap on the scores after the second scoring round. I'm on five. Yes. Uh, Maniki's on eleven. And two more coming. on twelve, I believe. Three, six, seven, uh, eight. Two more coming out. Eleven. Oh, two more coming out. So you're on fourteen. Okay. Cool. Right, yeah. we are now in phase yeah. C, it's... and it is me. Oh, right, I haven't got a plan yet. Um, <laughs> so, let's have a look. Uh, oh, no, I do have a plan. It is to do that. And to do that, I need to do... Oh, now, is it time for me to get uh -oh. into this whole whiskey thing? 
points. <laughs> yeah, you can't lose this whole... eight points. No, with a whiskey. Uh, I think I don't know it if it's might worth be... it. That eight points nullifies your card, Paul. Yeah, so I'm I'm gonna take this. Uh, and it's gonna go there. It's gonna cost me a stone to take it, and that goes there. Uh, and it comes with a whiskey barrel. Nice. Take, take my first whiskey barrel. Uh, and then the special ability is to either move a whiskey barrel or convert a wheat into a whiskey barrel. So I will convert. Uh, no, let's leave that one there. Let's convert this one. Oh, it's barley, actually. Barley into whiskey. Okay, so that's that. Uh, and I also get one, two, three movement points. So we're going to move this one. Was that tile just one in front of you on the rondelle? Uh, yes, that's it right just yeah, so yeah, it's okay. going yeah, it. to okay. be me again. Um, yep. Okay, there we go. Right, now the next thing is... I don't think I'm going to take that. What's this? Ah, now... Oh, I'm not doing that well for resources at the moment, actually. So... Mm -hmm. Oh, gosh. Um, right. Believe it or not, I'm actually going to zoom you can drop it. Yeah, there. all the way around to here. Oh, wow. Yeah, because oh. I like this guy. I didn't see that coming. Yeah, I mean, check out his freckles. So, oh, I mean, James the second. Yeah, who can't? Who, Paul does have James a massive the kingdom. I do have a massive kingdom. Those <laughs> <laughs> are all negative three points. Per I know. So I take James the second, wow. um, and that allows me to take one of the clans, and I'm actually going to take this one. Which cost I'm me a coin, discard. but okay. because I have six river tiles, I get eight points as an immediate one. Oh, you got that spot. Nice. Wow. That's a good one. Go. That was a good one. So I, I was planning uh, that. <laughs> that puts my barrels yeah. to shame. There you I go. saw it happening. There's nothing we could do about it. Eight points. Yeah. Okay. Well, very good. Turn. So we get two new sea tiles, and Ooh. we're off. There you go. Um, I'm going to. Oh, okay. I'm gonna take the luck shield. Sh shield. Shield, I think. Really. Yeah. Shield. Shield. Okay. Whichever. So I will take this one, and it's a. Oh, is it a river? Yeah, it's a river. It is a so river, I have yeah. to. I am required to place it here, and oh. it gets me the oh, card for it. Yep. Which is this one. And the card gives me a person and a whiskey barrel. So let's take the whiskey and oh, all that whiskey. a person to go on the actual lock. Mm -hmm. And now I can activate some things. Yep. So I get two barrel movements and one person movement. Mm -hmm. So let's do the barrel movements first. I'm going to pay my last coin. Wow, here we go. My last... <laughs> coin to get the last or the third yeah. seller oh my gosh money well i might as well do it i'm kind of all in i don't have any more money you all in <laughs> might as well continue this with round the, is going fast. the barrel yeah. game so i'm gonna double i'm gonna move this forward twice so now it's there and then i get to move a person so i need more access to places so i'm gonna move this one up here well hold on no i'm gonna move it here yeah that's it. Amazing. Okay. So whatever you did, amazing. Okay. <laughs> Some more tiles. Uh, I think that's it. So you want to put this. Yeah. There you go. My mouse is stuck. Is your mouse stuck? Oh no, you're good. It's doing, well, it's doing the thing where it's like rotating my screen and not actually allowing me to move. Don't right click. <laughs> <laughs> that's weird. So I think I'm going to take this cow right here. This one? Ga yeah. Galloway. Yep. I'll move your meeple. Yeah. Thank you. And I'm okay. going to place it in one of the two legal spots that I have. Oops, not there. Huh. Yeah. Okay. So that gives me a cow. And it allows me to move. I have this ability now that I've unlocked. So I can spend two wheat for another barrel, or I can move a barrel up two spots. So I will move a barrel up two spots by buying an extra... Yep, so you've got your stage two seller. Um, yeah, is that the one right here? 
<laughs> this is so fun. This one. Oh. <laughs> I gotcha. Let's rotate. And then I'll move it up to. Oh, you one. bought a cellar? Uh oh. Yeah. I did. So, yeah, that's my coin that's above here. I promise. That's a good one. <laughs> okay, and then I get movement. I need to get out of this castle area, but we're dying here. Okay, one. <laughs> I, yeah, can that's, I concede my castle. That's what's tough about uh, preparing for scoring. You have to like put all your people like, in one everyone pile. Come back. Yeah, and it's like, wait, back. no, I need you out. <laughs> okay, that's that's something that's better in this version than the first edition. In the first edition, in order to get the scoring for the people, you have to actually move them from the castle to an out of game area. And they only score oh. when they'd been removed and you can't then bring them back at least in this game you, you gather them together and you can then use them again so uh, yeah. oh wow so you're just like spending them yeah that, you, that's, yeah. Uh, that's, that's tough and i think that was the end of my turn i moved that's it i got the cattle okay yeah okay uh, i am... have the uh, the barrel selling that's tempting but i think <laughs> yeah, i'm so... gonna go with you know i have all these cows or cattle or cows, I think they're cows. And I'm not doing anything with them, so I might as well get this tile. Yep. Yeah. And I'm going to place it here, so which them away. is going to allow me to spend three of them mm -hmm. for seven points. Yeah. So I'm going to spend one, I will get your two. Points. I'm spending the third one, but activating this tile will get it back. So I'm going to put it back here. And then uh, because I placed that there, I get, OK, I can't activate that tile because I don't have any wheat. So I can move two barrels over. So I'm going to move this barrel to the final spot and I'm going to move this barrel over one. And that's it. I gave you 10 points and then yes. three away. So. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you. That's the end of your turn? Yes. Right. Okay, new tile comes out. Well, since what I have a tile that's ah, very Armadale similar Castle. to eat. There it is. <laughs> Armadale Castle. I will do this. I'm going to take this uh, river tile. Okay. It's called, uh, I can't read, Shiplock? Cheviot. Chev Cheviot. Cheviot. Okay, and I'm going to place it here, which gives me a sheet, but, I'm, but it activates the tile in its top left corner, which is turn into uh, animals. So I have the sheet that I just acquired. Yeah. Plus this uh, cow Camera that I have here. For four points. Perfect. Yeah. I will steal one point then... of you and give you a five. Okay, perfect. There you go. And then I can move. Okay, I'll move here. <laughs> one move. That's it? That's it? Uh, yeah, I got to move my meatball though. Third, okay. Yeah. So, yeah, Monique, you're up. Okay, I'm going to take this person. Yeah. Right, okay. And this is, uh, oh, I cannot pronounce um, the person's name, but it's the person. <laughs> it and... is uh, Fiongul Nick Dom Hanel. There you go. I'm sure ah. that's, that's completely wrong, but. Yeah. <laughs> so I need to go onto this clan uh, board here, mm -hmm. but I don't have any money. Mm. So. Ah, well, you could take what three is, money. What... Straight up I know. I was thinking about that. What do you know? What McGregor does? Uh, it looks like infinitely. Right. I can. Well, it looks like multiple people can go there. Uh, oh yeah, McGregor. If you activate a whiskey oh, tile. Oh. oh no! This is the one where in the physical game there is a counter here, because when you take McGregor, it gives you a permanent ability now for the rest of the game. That whenever you activate a whiskey tile, you may choose not to use the activation effect to produce whiskey and instead get three points. Mm. So oh. When, whenever you would produce whiskey, you can forego that to get three points instead. Interesting. I don't know how I feel about that with the with the third chronicle in play. So yeah, you are apparently I butchered the game. pronunciation. Gonna... <laughs> I thought I would. Oh, did you? <laughs> apparently so. Yeah. yeah. The phonetic spelling. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna just take, take three money. I don't know if that was an option, but <laughs> yeah. I can stare at this board all day. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> so money's... I'm gonna take three money. Yeah. Money is points. Money, money is, is points, points and... and... 
you need you it. You need it. Okay, so. so. Yeah. Right, okay, so Wait. I had a plan, and that plan was to take, to grow my empire even more. Mm -hmm. Lots of negative points at the end of the game, but this is going. <laughs> uh, where's it going? Where is it going? Get rid of these. It is going here. Okay. And then it comes with um, stone. Uh, then it generates wheat. Then it also generates wood. And then I get a movement point. Uh, and that movement point, I think, is going to be this one back into the castle. There we go. He's a bit drunk. Um, and then what I'm going to do is I am going to spend the stone for two coins because we haven't got enough money. Um, <laughs> yeah, my computer seems to be running very slow. The, the hand is yeah. is freezing quite a lot. Um, uh, I'm oh, there seems to be a coin missing on the wood. Coin missing on the. Oh, wood. okay. Let's. Uh, should we just put one up here? Yeah, because I am I gonna sell. The bank. I am gonna sell wood as well. Oh, ah, nice. wow, you are yeah. fantastic at manipulating the market. And I ah. think I'm also going to sell the wheat for another two coins. Yes. There you go. Right. Whew. Yeah, I think well, that's then. it. <laughs> and then we get another C tile. Yeah, I got it right here. Oops, I got it. Oh, I got it. Uh, it's Loch Ness, yeah. which eats a person when you Ooh, take the tile. <laughs> Uh, is there an extra coin on the sheep? Says Scott. No, I think he's good. Yeah, there should be two on there. Yeah, I think so. I think when I had initially stacked it, it didn't quite, right. you know. Okay, yeah, we're good. Mm, luck, yes. Well, it's my turn. Um... Oh, Loch Ness oh. eats a person. <laughs> yeah, and that person oh. cannot be... Uh, so, where you place Loch Ness... The person you eat the person before you place the tile. So in other words, you can't eat a person and then put the tile next to where that person was, which is a shame. I think thematically oh. you should have to put the tile mm -hmm. next to where the person was eaten. But that makes yeah. sense. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's interesting, actually. That's w okay. So I'm looking at Glen. Glen Alden. Alden. Yeah. So that lets you do both. You can you can move a uh, a whiskey barrel and spend a wood yeah. and a wheat really? to. Yeah. What's the best it's good. value I can get here? Six points? It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. But I could also just straight up get four points by going here. Yeah. I will things. take this. I'm going to take this and go here. Okay. And I'm going to rotate it. And so this tile itself gives me a sheep. The tile, it activates to this diagonal here, it gives me yeah. another sheep which activates this, so I'm turning those two sheep I would have acquired to turn into okay. four points. I will take your points. So I'll just grab a five and tackle. Yeah, I've given the one back. Did you take the one? I did. Yeah, the one has been taken. Well, thank you. And awesome. you also get a wood yeah. on uh, Inshriach. <laughs> oh. Oops. Wait. I should have done that on the previous turn as well. Oh. You a, it take, take a wood if you rode one. Yeah, I, yeah it, I did the exact same turn the previous turn. Okay, thank you. <laughs> right. Okay. Oh, it's me again. Uh, right, so all of that coin uh, let me taken get in the yeah. was I delivered the because I'm now taking this one. Okay, I'm moving your meeple. Thank you very much, Robert Burns. And I'm going to take this clan over here, uh, which, because I've got 12 money, I get 8 points. Wow! Good job. <laughs> Five uh, and a three. Dang it. There you go. Right, that is the extent of my plans. So. That was good. Oh my god. Oh no, I've got Solid. one more plan. You know, <laughs> one more plan. I think um, my wait. hand is being forced here. But wait, there's more. 
my hand is being forced against my will. Uh, you're going to sell see. that whiskey for like 15 points. Why wouldn't you? Yeah, what are you doing there? Is that max money? Yeah. Well, it's not that. I need to take this tile away from Paul. No, you don't. Which tile? The castle. It's only eight points. Hold on. Can I even place it? Yes, I can. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm going to do it. <laughs> because, oh. because it's the one that, that lets you... Uh, because you have so much money. It's yeah, like... It's not uh, help you. <laughs> I know, He's like, but, I know but, but it gives me a person but. and I'm gonna hop off <laughs> hop over this tile instead of um landing on it so let's it's do that right. first actually I, I've I hopped had a word. over the whiskey tiles I've had a word with the former owner of Armadale Castle and they've left a few uh a few traps for you so <laughs> okay so I'm gonna place my barrel um here and I'm yeah. selling it for 15 points because that was where it uh yeah. was on when 15 I points. when it left me Fifteen points, points, and then I have to. Thank 10. you. Now, I have to figure out how to afford this. So this is my wheat. I'm selling this uh, cattle for one coin. One coin, yeah. And putting in all my money, actually, oh, for a stone. And what is the other thing that I need? Hold on. It's a stone and a wood. Yeah. So, here's the stone. Oops. One. This is like some fine motor skill. So you, here. you just lost loads what of points by doing that. So. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't. Uh, I don't <laughs> think I meant. Like I didn't like calculate the net value of that. What but like, minus six uh, points to you. Yeah, yeah. I'm taking. <laughs> <laughs> this my is very, my very, may very well be my downfall, but I'm taking that and I get a person right yep. there, and it take, it gives me the 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 uh, whatever this yeah. is called the card. Yeah, yeah there the you card. Go. That's good. So yeah, now my new goal get... to gain money. Yeah, if you can get money by the end of the game, then it's, yeah, it's work I do out. have a little bit of time. Oh, that the one that, uh, That's for... why, because you have so much money, oh, it, would have been it would have been uh, multiplied by two. I support this move. Only the first eight, is... so it would have been eight. The first, the first eight. eight, yeah. So Monique has zero, so that's perfect. It <laughs> that's perfect for Paul. you. I think the only winner here was Nadine. It takes away from that Paul, move. <laughs> I can't do anything with it. You've turned Excellent. a Euro game to a three-player war game. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it's that map over there. It just, it just brings it out in you, you know? Maybe, it's a, it's yeah, well... Oh, wait, sorry. I, I apologize. I placed this tile and I'm actually supposed to activate these. Oh, yeah. oh, so, yeah, just these two. It's... Actually, just this. <laughs> I don't have a wheat. Oh, what have I done? I've just, like, zapped myself of resources. But I am going to move this barrel over one. I'm just going to okay. what one of the clans does. Oh, goes back there. Yeah. oh, oops. I'm trying to play the Chronicle 3 game. Oh, you're playing it. It's making me yeah. make strange decisions. <laughs> yeah. Wait, did you end up selling your whiskey? I yeah, I did. Yeah, yeah one. Yeah, did. I sold yeah. one of them because I, I uh, bypassed it, so I only got one. Paul, will you be selling whiskey anytime soon? Yeah, it's only worth <laughs> two points if I do, but it does take points off you, but not many. Hey. <laughs> I can okay. feel your anxiety. I mean... We can be civil here, okay? <laughs> I will take this tile. Oh wait, this one flips over. And that one goes, yeah, thank you. And this cost me a wood. So I'm gonna put it here, which is a perfect placement. Oh, okay. okay. So it gives me a whiskey. Yeah. Which is all the... Oh, that's a good oh. tile, that one. Fine motor movement, no good. It's a very good tile. Okay. So this has to go on my far left, so it's, it's a cheapy. It's a cheapy. So oh, there. you got Glenn. I, you did, yeah. So then yeah. it also gives me the ability to move a barrel. So I'll move it over. And then um, I can turn in a wheat and a wood, which I do have. So I'll turn in this wheat and this wood to create a new barrel. Or is that a new barrel? Is that what this is? Hmm. Okay, a new barrel is coming in. Which gets dropped off in the second place. I apologize, I'm very bad at this. <laughs> there. And then that activates a bunch of tiles. So I get a wheat back. I activate the two sheep. So I'm doing that move again where I, I take the two sheep. Okay. And then it's going to convert into a four. Yeah. So I'll grab the five if somebody wants to put back the one. one. Yeah. Thank you. 
and then that is the end, I believe. I got the wheat, the two sheep I turned in for points, mm -hmm. and I moved. Yep. So it's whether I want this or not. Um, Do it. Because it is quite a nice time, nice. I think. Um, Which one? This. The one right in front of them. Oh. Yeah, oh. Edredor. Um, I'm just. Uh. It kind of doesn't fit <laughs> with the sort of rough plan that I have. Sort of rough, maybe ish. Um, and I don't actually have the stone, so I'd have to buy the stone. And that right now costs. Three. Three. Ouch. <laughs> yeah, stones are expensive. Stone is expensive. Um, so, uh, yeah, I do have a sort of other plan. Oh, I just realized I was supposed to move a person when I place that tile. Let's see. That other plan requires me taking. So, what does Loch Ness do? Is that the one that you activate? Unless you activate a your... tile. Oh, activate uh, an one extra tile. tile per turn. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, which is quite nice. Um, but I think I'm going to go a bit crazy and we're going to zoom <laughs> all the way ahead to here. Oh. Oh. Yeah, let's do that. So I'm going to take this uh, and we're going to put it here. And then it comes with a person. Um, I then get a wood, a wheat, and a stone. So, a wood, a wheat, and a stone. And then I get one movement point, which will be... Uh, Are you going to sell a barrel, by the way? <laughs> oh, yeah, actually, I'm going. not going to put it there. I'm actually going to okay. put it there. So I don't get the... I don't get the wood. But I do get this, which is convert a wheat into a barrel. Yeah, when do I have to make that decision of selling the barrel? When um, you bypass, when you I bypass guess it. technically because you bypassed it, you do it first? I, I would I think, think so. Think so, so. Yes, yeah. I am. I am going to put that on ah, there. Okay. And I'm going to get myself two points. I'm going to give in a one nice. and take a three. Um, How many barrels do you have? One, two, three, four, five. I only have one five. now, but I'm about oh. to activate um, this which will move this one to here. So that's that one done, and I've got two movement points, so that one's going back home. There you go. Now, do I want to sell any resources? I don't think I do, because I'm fine for money. So, <laughs> although money is points, no, I think we're okay. So, okay. yeah. Okay, my go done? is done. My empire okay. is way too big. Well, now I can't sell, because you guys cornered yeah. the market. <laughs> I thought we were being civil, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> All fair and love and war. And okay. whiskey. Well, and whiskey. <laughs> and whiskey. Yeah. Ooh, what is this? What is this overbuild here? This says Iona Abbey. I'm so sorry if I mispronounced that. Yeah, Iona Abbey. Okay. It basically it generates a resource every time you activate mm. it. Any resource. Ooh, Ken Brian is in the chat, and Brian said his favourite moment in Scotland is seeing Radiohead live in a big top ten in Glasgow around 2000. Oh, so my awesome. favourite moment in Scotland awesome. is Love I went a walk, on a walking holiday in the late 90s, and the plan was we were going to walk from, uh, I think it was Inverness, and uh, we were going to walk all the way along the coast of Loch Ness, um and then all the way along the coast of Loch Lochy and we didn't get very far we gave up after like two days um and we <laughs> went back to Inverness and we stayed in a campsite for about four or five days in Inverness just chilling uh and Runrig were playing and I'd never heard of Runrig at the time uh and Runrig were playing in a nearby field but because it was an outdoor concert and we were in a campsite next door we basically got a free Runrig concert um and then I discovered Runrig and realized how brilliant they are so uh yeah that was, that oh, was probably nice. my favorite moment from Scotland that's quite cool. That's really cool. What does Loch Ness do for us in this game? That lets you activate one tile, a bonus tile per turn that you haven't act activated already. Oh. Yeah. 
a nice one. Oops. You have to spend a person, though. Oh, that, yeah. is that the cost? That is the cost. Cost is a person, uh -huh. yeah. A human sacrifice. Naveen loves Radiohead, by the way. Oh, right, yeah, cool. Yeah, we saw them at Coachella a couple years ago. Really yeah. awesome. Well, I'm, I'm going to dig Apparently out Apparently, they're doing a live CDs. stream uh, oh, are performance. They? Yeah, within the, I got an email. I'm, oh, that's I'm on their mailing list. You're on the mailing list? Yeah. <laughs> All right, I should probably take my turn and not joke around. All right. <laughs> Loch Ness, please be good to me. Gosh, I'm in big trouble here. I can't even legally place Loch Ness. Stop looking at it again. <laughs> I'm going to do the overbuild. I'm going to do the overbuild just because I don't want to build more to my territory. So you're going to there. Okay. So thank you, thank you. These. So that cost this wood, my one wood. And now I'm going to overbuild. It has to be over this particular building type. Correct. So I'm going to overbuild over this wheat. Mm -hmm. So this wheat, wheat the wheat stays on the tile. Yep. And we are going to rotate. You spent the wood already for it? I did, yeah. OK, I'm so it gets you a resource of your choice. Do you know what you'd like? You know, I have that cattle thing going on. So I think I'm going to take a, oh, just give me a sheep. A sheep? Yeah. yeah. OK. Sheep. And it right goes there. on the tile itself, right? Yes. Yeah. So you are maxed out on that tile. Correct. What am I doing? So that gives me, because I, I use it, I activate all the tiles around. So I'm going to get a sheep, another sheep. Oh, sorry. You get oh, another sheep? I'm sorry. I'm just like telling you to do things. For me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Oops. That was still your point there. Here you go. Where does the sheep go? Oh, uh, no. It goes. Oh, here. It goes here, yeah. Okay. And then, since you're up, do you mind getting me a whiskey barrel? <laughs> sure. <laughs> here okay. you go. I'm Perfect. Some it goes drinks. there, right? Uh, it goes there, yeah. And then I have the ability to move a whiskey barrel, so I'm going to max this one out. You making change there, Paul? Yeah, I'm, I'm just no, I taking some points. And then I get uh, two movement points, so everyone run back to the castle. Yeah, <laughs> Hurry. because the scoring has been triggered. Dark. <laughs> okay. Oh, I know. Because they were going to score, right? Yeah. yeah. Yes. I've, I've I didn't the move my tiles person. out, and we are scoring. Early enough. OK, you'll go finish, Nadine? I, I think so. Right, so first scoring, yeah. people in the castle. Who has the fewest? I have three in the castle. I have Five. two. <laughs> OK, so Nadine, you get <laughs> what have one I done? point, and I get three. Really uh, like next is cards. Yep, that's, that's two. I have three cards. I have three as well. I have one. So ah. you guys both get two points. We both get yes. two points. One. Perfect. Two. Uh, next is whiskey barrels. I have one. I have five. Oh, so yes. you get five points for having four more than me. Uh, three Nadine, you've got having... three more than me, so you get three points. And then people. Uh... People, oh, I have two. I have three. I think you guys all got it. I thought I had three. No, I don't. I've got two. I yeah, I, think that. I took a third one. Maybe I didn't. Um, so it's one point for Monique. Three. Well, well, how many do you... Oh, yeah. That's right. So, uh, Paul, you have three chits on the clan map. Did yeah. you get one from a benefit somewhere else? I did. Oh, yeah, you did. Yeah, your Duarte part. Castle that's got one. Yeah. yeah. That's a good way to check. Yeah, that's true. Wow, okay. we are already in the last round. So... So, scoring like update. That. I am on 28. Um, I have 30, 8, 9, 10, 41. Okay. Uh, 29. Well, you guys <laughs> wow. have all that money. Yeah, that $4. That is true. That is... Yeah. I, I like, I have... I'm on 15 points more than I actually am. If we add on the 15 points, I'm on... Yeah. Uh, it's good to be flexible with the money. 40, 43 with my money. And I'm here. I have no money and no resources. This is not ideal. Uh, not <laughs> this is ideal. not the way that I foresaw how this game was <laughs> yeah. going to go. Right. So um, I'm going to take Loch Ness because it's pretty much like one of the only ones that I can take. So I must, um, I must spend a person to do that. So I'm going to yep. spend this person. And this is a river tile, so it's going to go here. And it gives me the Loch Ness. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Place. Place. Okay. It gives me the Loch Ness card. Oh, thank you. So now that lets me act one thing 
per round that I haven't used, right? Yeah. So first I'm going to activate this tile, which lets me move a barrel over. So let's move that over here. Mm -hmm. uh, I can activate this also to move a person, which I will do. I'm going to move this person <laughs> home. <laughs> Go home. OK. And then I'm going to activate a third, another tile using my Loch Ness. So I'm just going to activate this one, which lets me move a barrel over again. Yeah, nice. And then that's it. Yeah. Still okay. no money and no resources. Two more tiles. <laughs> OK. Well, there's this strapping gentleman here. Charles, Charles I. Is the first. Charles the first. Charles, Charles I. I. Charles I. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Charles I dot. No, oh, yeah. definitely Charles the first. Hmm. <laughs> Charles, I was He's got a sly look on his face. He does. He's definitely up to something. He's looking good. <laughs> I like his look. Are you going to take him? <laughs> I probably should, yeah. Yeah, I don't want to add to my territory. Okay. Yeah, and so it. now we're getting a little bit territory nervous. Yeah. yeah I'm all, and I get to go. 12. Let's see. All right. I'm at 4, you 8, 9, 10, 11. Okay. this board up over here. Let's see what you guys have left me with. Okay. Now, three points is nice, but what else can we get here? So, I don't have some at the Let's have a check at what I've got. Yeah, I mean, looking at these is is good, but you need a you need a clamp to be able to take it. So this is uh, this one that's the infinity. What is this again? Uh, uh, so basically, once you've got this ability, uh, you may forego movement points in order to get a victory point. Every time you forego a movement point, you get a victory point. Really? Yeah. Clan Kyle McLachlan. Oh man, that's kind of nice. Huh. And then McPherson over here. Uh, McPherson is immediately score victory points for the number of overbuilt tiles in your territory. Mm. Do I only have one? I think I only have one. Yeah, you you only need two. Oh, yeah, I see. Then... <laughs> <laughs> well, so it won't do you any. <laughs> It's true. Okay, so no, it's, it's not gonna work. That's not gonna work. Let's just go do something quick. Okay. And that quick thing will be, I'm gonna take the David Hume. Oh, you are. Yeah. Yeah, it gives me two more characters. Faces. Two characters. Yeah. So you have to pay. You have, you have to pay, pay two coins uh, to get it, whichever way you go. Yeah. Right. Well, is that even worth it? Uh, I mean, how many face tiles do you have now? That's Three? Goal, you only have five. Oh, you, no, I, I see something a little bit better. In this top top left corner, McDonald? Yeah. yeah, you can activate uh, two, uh, one of each tile. Yeah, a barrel tile. Yeah. A production one and, and, a, and a whiskey one. Definitely yeah, have a barrel type. So I'm going to activate this barrel type, which is double move. So I'm going to buy. So in order to go there, I have to pay one, correct? Yeah. Okay, so there's my one. Okay. And then that. I'm going to buy a new um, uh, seller. Yep. And then I'm going to double move this best <gasps> barrel Gosh. that I have. Gosh, Naveen. Really hoping to that that in. card shows up that I need. I'm just going for it. You are going for it. I'm going for it. <laughs> this is Chronicle 3, everyone. One, two. <laughs> it's true. You wouldn't think it from the way I'm playing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. well, Paul's like, this is the chronicle where you just get a bunch of money. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I money activated that. Points. I can then turn into wheat for another whiskey, mm -hmm. which I will. And what's the other uh, chit that I can, or what's the other uh, tile I can activate? It says. Where have you placed uh, tile type? Oh, it's, it's a one barrel and one like a. It looks like a box. a box. I think it's technically like an industry. Which is this one? Which is any any resource I want? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All I will time. then do that for a cow. Okay. Great. Excellent. 
Okay. Um, Donnie's in the chat saying he hasn't played Chronicle 3 before. It looks great. Yeah, Chronicle 3 is, is interesting. What, what's also interesting is each of the Chronicles in the back of the book says how complex it is and how much it adds to the length of the game, which is really nice. And Chronicle 3 says yeah. it is a medium to play Chronicle, I guess medium complexity, and it adds 10 minutes to the game time. Um, so yeah, if you were to play with all of the Chronicles added in, it would double the length of the game because that adds 5 minutes, that adds 5 minutes, that adds 10 minutes, that adds 10 minutes. Uh, but yeah, they all add something a little bit different right. to the game and mixes it up a bit, which is good. Nice. I took Dorney, by the way, because now that I have put myself in a position of having no resources, mm -hmm. there's not very much that I can take. Right. So I'm gonna, it is a uh, river tile, so it has to go It's free to here. take, it's gonna go it? here. Yeah. It does oh, give me a- no money time. either. You have no money and no resources. I don't have any money. Right, Yeah, wow. not, not the best uh, situation. But you are gonna but... get a cow. Put that there, yes, I get a cow, yeah, which cow. also doesn't, doesn't sell for anything. <laughs> no, and you don't want cows. <laughs> I get three movement points, so I'm gonna move this over one and do i want to move the other ones over no nah. i'm gonna leave the people where they are outside of that and then i'm gonna tap into my lo my Loch ness card mm -hmm. and move move my barrel over i'm just tapping one of the tiles that allow me to move my barrel over okay so there it is all right so new tiles have come out, and we now have yep. the selling whiskey tile. Ah, the last so one. The last one, and we also it's have not even the end of the world. The pack horse the... Yeah, the end of the world is <sighs> somewhere nuts. in the middle. It's like four tiles yeah. down from where we are. Right, I, I desperately need a clan, but there's nothing mm. in the game that I don't. Yeah, I don't think there's anything there that gives me a clan. There isn't. It's just all trading in animals <laughs> we don't want any trading in animals um uh, oh, there is that one which converts four different resources into nine points i don't have four different resources but i could easily buy a cow yeah that would true. give me four different resources for nine points but it does cost me a wood and a wheat to make which i do have hmm the other option is Milburn, which is also quite nice. <laughs> Not an overbuild though, so it's going to cost me three points to take it. Um, oh gosh. Yeah, this is this is tricky. I, this yeah, is really yeah, tricky. yeah. I think I'm going to take <laughs> uh, Glenys Lafer. Oh, you are. Oh, Naveen wanted that one. I was, I was looking at it. I was zooming in. Good on job, it. Paul. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we're going to take that. So it is an overbuild onto a production space. Uh, where are we going to overbuild? I think. Yeah, overbuilding is the way to go. Yeah. Oh, now, I didn't really want to do that, but I kind of want to activate that. But I can't, so it's going to have to be overbuild onto here. So yeah, we're going to overbuild. So we're going to knock down this forest here and we're going to build a fair on it. So that cost me a wood, which will be that one. And it's going to cost me a wheat, which will be that one. Uh, and then I get to activate all of these surrounding tiles. So I get a wheat, I get a stone, um, I get two movement points, which I will send this one home. Oh, not the tile, this one. We'll send him home. <laughs> Do we want to send him home? Okay. No. I think we're gonna... Oh. Yeah. Tough decision. No, we're going to leave him there. And then I get <laughs> to sell four different resources. So there's the stone. There's the wheat. I'm then going to buy a cow, which I then sell. Uh, and then I'm going to buy. Uh, oh. Oh, it's going to have to be, I think. Is it worth doing that? Oh, I don't know if it's worth doing that. Because then I'm selling for... Oh, no, it is. Just. No, not going to do that. Give me that coin back. <laughs> so I, I, I just sold two resources for four points. Instead of four for nine. 
mm-hmm. not quite worth it at this stage. So yeah, four points, and that is me done. Okay. okay. Well, I'm not going very far. I'm taking this thing right here. So this okay. one right here is uh, any combination of cattle. Yeah. Uh, sell two for five points, or sell three for eight. So I definitely three for eight. Three for eight. That uh, would have been a nice one earlier for you. Yeah. Everyone just moved along on that one, so I, I can only place it here. It's, it's kingdom for... size. That's the thing. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I just want to tie with whoever has the most. <laughs> uh, I don't know about that. So... I got twelve. I have, I have twelve also. So mm-hmm. excellent. <laughs> okay, so. I mean, I think you look like you have. Four, eight, nine, now. Ten, yes. 13. Maybe <laughs> minus three. Right. Okay. <laughs> Mine looks yeah, bigger because it's long. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So uh, I can sell three animals. Let's do it. So I have exactly three animals. That means you yeah. did some good compacting there, Paul, because for a while there, you had yes. a, a lot more tiles. Yeah. Well, I've done a couple of um, overbuilds and took a character. Yeah. So, Monique, do you mind just getting me eight points? Eight points? Yeah, sure. Well, if you take a 10, uh, I'll take I'm gonna give it, yeah. Here's your okay, 10. perfect. And then I activate the tile to its left, which is move the barrel. I get twice, so I, I oh, max out that barrel. One. Nice. E2. And I get to move now. Is it... Should I be moving? I should be moving. Look, look. <laughs> so let's go one. Yeah, because you can't really build anywhere with everybody at home in the castle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's... I'm fenced in. Okay. Your your people are completely surrounded. Okay, we'll, we'll do that. Okay, and then you go again. You got me those. Yeah, things? we get another. I oh, did. Yeah. Where did oh. that come from? That came from there. There we go. Now there's this overbuild. Rock Sea Harbor. Rock Sea Harbor has come out. Nice. It'd be, right. it'd be cool to like uh, go to all these places one day. You know? Scotland is a lovely, lovely country to visit. Yeah, I've, I've heard. It's uh, it's a long way north for me because I live down in the southwest of England, so it's yeah, it's it's a long way for me to get there, but it is lovely. Well, it's nice. As you guys have been pointing out, you don't want to add to the kingdom. No, you can. Yeah, you can. You're very welcome to. <laughs> it's, fine, it's fine if you do. It's fine with us. You know what? I think it's time to say goodbye to all the whiskey. What? We come. <gasps> He's done it. So you okay, get to so sell I twice. Have a max I have a 15. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Can't believe what am I just happened. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Oh, what happened to that barrel? There it is. That's one of them. And this one is at 5. So it's going to be 20 point turn. Okay. I will give you a 20. Thank you. So 1. And then because I stopped on it, I get to sell to this corner. Yeah. That's the world's that. End time that's has come out. That's that. The yeah. world's end. There it is. There it is. Uh, I now just 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 to let you know, Monique. Yes. There is only one space left on this. I know. Here. He's he's definitely pushing my hand here. Yeah. And that means I can only sell one barrel. I can't sell both. Yeah. So I'm going to. And I didn't add to my kingdom. I have to bypass this tile. I don't have <laughs> yeah. any money, so I'm not going to take the person uh, tile. So I'm going to take this one. Yeah. And what I'm going to do... Oh, do I even have a legal placement for it? Ah, uh, yes, uh, I do. Okay. Yes, here, um, Yeah, that's true. I can do that. I'm going to do that. Which... But before I do that, I think I have to sell my whiskey first. So I'm going to sell this last barrel for 15 points. Oh. Mm-hmm. And then... I'll get you um, 15. Oh, thank you. I'm going to move this over. I'm going to move this. I'm going to put this here, right there. And so that gives me two, uh, sorry, it gives me a stone and a wood, which I'm just going to sell for these four coins. Because yeah, to me, sure. this is going to be eight eight points, I think, yeah. if yeah. that's how that card that took works. So, wow. Oh, it feels so good to have money again. <laughs> that was stressful. You could have always borrowed some of me. I'm, I'm open for, you know, <laughs> lending. You're so kind. Right. Uh, and then so, so I get to move people. Yeah. Well, that's let's see what's... Sped things up quite a bit, hasn't it? I don't... I can also choose to land on the world end tile, right? If I don't want to take any more... Yes. And if you land there, that's it. Let's... Your your game is over. Yeah, when you... 
and or pass, or only when you pass? No, if you, I think if you land on it, you're you're considered done. I got yeah. you. Okay, I'm going to move this person twice. So one, two. Just bringing, bringing this person home. Okay. That's it. Well, I is definitely taking the character. Um, uh, because I think there is an eight-point card here for me. Yes, there is. Um, is there? Yeah. <laughs> Get over there. Well, I've been collecting towns as well, or villages. It's just going to be quite expensive to buy. Um, yeah, it's going to cost me. It's going to cost me two. So it's it's still a six-point move. Yeah, that's all right. Um, so yeah, it cost me two coins. I have four coins. Um, yeah. No barrels, I'm sorry. But yeah, oh, I, take I have four barrels, And yes. I get six points. So I will put put four back. No, six points, eight points. What am I on about? Uh, <laughs> let's take five Being nice to us, Paul. And a three. <laughs> well, it's a net six, but I've just spent the two coins. Um, uh, yeah, that's, that's it. So these go as well. Yeah, we're having a lot of... It's gone very quick, hasn't it? Um, yeah. Let's see a face. There's a face. Oh, were you looking for oh, a face? I don't want to look. Oh, there's another oh, one. Face. Excellent. Please look at this person's mustache. Oh, Arthur Conan Doyle. It's pretty nice. Wow. And Victoria Kailani. Yeah. <laughs> Check out those eyelashes. <laughs> They're totally fake. Yeah. yeah. They, they must be. <laughs> Yeah, they, they must be. He's on our game. Okay, let's... Where are find... you going to go? So because you have four barrels, Monique, and I have three... What? Well, you looking at my barrels? That he regularly drove from Aberdeen to Torquay. Wow. Torquay's down near me. So that must be, what, a 12-hour About... drive or something like that? Oh, wow. Yeah. That's like from... Well, I think from San Francisco to Washington. Just lock more for us. Quite far. That's probably an idea. You want to know what lock more more are? Well, does? I can't even do it, and it oh, just okay. adds to more territory. So okay. I can't even legally place it. I think I have to go to one of these people. Yeah. Right. Aberdeen directions to talking. So I have another. Is five hundred and sixty-six miles. It would take one hundred and eighty-seven hours to walk. Yeah, not walking, driving. Uh. Wow. Okay, ten hours. Or eleven hours. Oh. Yeah, it's quite a while. But yeah. I mean it's it's almost one end of the country or one end of the, the yeah. yeah. Southwest of Britain to the not quite, yeah. I mean Inverness is probably further away. So anyway, meanwhile, enough about job. <laughs> I am trying to figure out how many uh how many faces does everyone have? People that everyone have? I have, have three. three. Yeah. That's all you have? He has three, three also. Three as well. Oh, boy. Okay. David Hume is not worth it. I could also just take three points. Mm -hmm. You could. It's just a nice, I think that's easy. the only thing. Because I, I only have one overbuild, right? That's what I said. And I haven't changed that. Yeah, yeah. One overbuild. Yeah. I'm going to take three coins, because anything else costs me a coin to do, mm -hmm. which is fine, so, okay, three points. Okay, so this tile disappears, this tile disappears, uh, and it's my go, and this will be my last go. So, Hi. it's, what do I want to build? Now, I have people in four different locations, which is not quite enough for that. Uh, although I do, I could? No. Um, yeah, I'm looking to see if there's any of these, which is actually any use whatsoever. Uh, and I don't think there is. No. I, I was, I was going to grab another person, but actually... Yeah. Well, I don't think that's going to help. So, is any of these going to help me? Um... What have I got in the way of resources? I've got a wheat, I've got a stone. Uh, I could spend the wheat to get three whiskey. Well, that that's actually going to help because that would give me then four barrels, which is going to remove, mm -hmm. which is going to really uh, impact the points other people are going to get. 
although it is going to cost me three points to take it. Decreases that's our... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I could do an overbuild. Aha. <laughs> this one looks good. Ur can't ruin. Cost me a person, which is fine. Overbuild onto a castle, and then I can spend a resource to take a clan. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do that. That seems really good. So we'll take that one. That one too. Um, we are going to overbuild a castle. Uh, so we'll overbuild Castle Stalker. Uh, yeah. So I have to lose a person. So we'll lose this person here. Didn't like him anyway. Um, <laughs> and then I get to activate all of these things. So I take a wheat. I take a stone. Um, I can spend a resource to take a clan. So I'll spend a stone uh, to take a clan. Now I now have two. Oh, I have three overbuilds. Which means it is definitely okay. worth me taking <laughs> this one. Nice. Now, how, many, how much does that cost? Two. More than two. two. Yeah. Yeah. So that cost me two coins. Six point turn. Yeah. yeah. Gets me eight. He's making some making some moves. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh. I'll just put it in my hand. Okay, so that's that. And I've also got activate this location here, which is basically get a barrel. Um Yeah. So we take a barrel and we put it on there. So that's everything activated. Um and then because I'm not quite done, I'm gonna sell the wheat and sell the stone. For that mm -hmm. and that. Oh. Uh, made it back. Uh, yeah, so I good. think. I think that's it. I think that is my go. Yeah. Oh, and all the tiles are out. Okay, Every, I'm just gonna yeah. take this lock. Lock. Really? More out. Yeah, because I don't uh, really have anything. You don't want to take the face? No, because everything costs money, and I'm really trying to hold on to my money. So I'm going to place this here, mm -hmm. and it gives me the card, which I think lets me remove tiles. So I yeah. will I will let you know that taking three points does not cost you money. If That's you take, true. If you take the face. But I, I like the fact that this lets me remove tiles. Yeah, this is, yeah oh, it okay, removes yeah. two tiles, which is effectively six points. Is it just any two? Yeah. Okay. Well, you have uh, to maintain so contiguity, well... so you can't, you can't like, delete can't these two. The whole. I'm just going to remove these two. These two are going to be out. Oh, Jonathan's just popped in the chat. Hi, Jonathan. Thank you for joining in. Uh, Hi. And Matt is telling and us then, how um, long it takes to drive from Northern Virginia to Southern Florida, which is 17 to 18 hours. Yeah, I hear these stories when people are going to cons in America that they say, oh, mm -hmm. I drove. And I'm like, how long did it take you? And they say, oh, it took us two and a half days. <laughs> and I'm like, <Yeah>. what? <laughs> that's, a, that's a thing here. People really love to road go trip. on just road trips. Drive? Yeah. Okay, like a... right. Uh, I get these two, two resources for activating this tile, but I'm actually just going to sell yeah. the wood. I would have sold both, but... Uh, I'll take the coin for you. Oh, oh, thank you. And so I will keep the stone, because I can't sell it. You can sell stone, yeah. I wanted no. to. Nobody okay, and then the I get to... I'm going to activate these two, mm -hmm. which just lets me move this person over twice. Oh, and yeah, I sorry, can I have activate... three movement points. You sorry, back I, forgot. Oh. I forgot to do my three yeah. movement points. Go for it. Um, and then I can activate one more tile, but the barrels, the barrel selling, the whiskey selling is done, right? But so every it doesn't whiskey matter barrel is worth points. Yeah. If you hang on to them. If I hang on to them, but it doesn't really matter if I uh, progress them or not, right? No. I'm just going to activate the, the cow tile. I mean, it doesn't really do anything, but just do can it. You not, can you not gain another whiskey tile? Is it only, is it only improve? Oh yeah, I can, but I would have to turn in a wheat, which I don't have. So you could buy it's it for cost a coin, one coin, and you would get a coin like, back. Yeah, you eh, get a coin. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. No. Oh, if I didn't it. have any whiskey that's barrels, it. It, it would be worth it. Yes. Because it gets true. Really extra points. Right. So we do final scoring. First of all, people in the castle. Right. I've, I've got. got oh, people in the castle. Six, seven. Yeah, you I've guys got, got everyone home. I have five. Wow. And Naveen, Wait, hold on. No, no, two. I have six. I only have two, so. Three, two. Four, five, six. The points so are yours. Five points for Monique, eight points for me. Nice. Okay, next up, cards. 
I have three cards. Oh, uh, did you give me the five? Oh, sorry. Maybe I, I didn't no, grab it. Sorry. I did not do it. Okay, thank you. So three I cards for me. Okay. Car oh, cards. I have one, two, three, four, five. Wow. So you don't have five any cards? points have for you. Oh, you have one. Another so five points for you, Monique. Thank you. Okay, next okay. is whiskey barrels. I think I have the fewest with two. I have three. Yeah. I have four. Okay, so one point so to Levine, two points. two points to Monique. Yep. Okay, uh, yep. People, characters, I have three. I have four. I have three. Oh, so I don't get anything. Because you have, you have four, you said? Yeah. So, so you point. get a point for yours. Uh, nice. Okay, and then we check the size of territories. So I'm still I have 12. 12. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yeah. Ah, so, so you minus three, three points. Minus three, good. Five, three points. That wasn't okay. bad. That difference yeah. is usually yeah. yeah. Uh, and then it's points plus money. Oh yeah. So uh... Oh, okay. So just add now. Um... Okay, I have my number. Seventy-one. Yeah, sixty-one. Hold on, I'm having difficulty. So fifty, sixty, and then we get. So I get twice my money, right? Because of your card. yeah, yeah. Because of the card. So this is ten. Yeah. So five. Nailed oh, it. Money. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seventy-eight. Yeah, nice. seventy-eight. Nice. So yeah. seventy-eight, yeah. seventy-one, sixty-one. Oh, well played. Yeah, I got 61, 71, 78. Wow. That was, that was great. That was it fun. was good. I enjoyed Chronicle 3. Amazing. Yeah, I like Chronicle That's 3 a good as Chronicle. well. Yeah. Chronicle yeah. 3, I feel like it's you, ha you're, you have to go for it. <laughs> you just have to go for it. I you mean, know, I, did, to, I didn't Chronicle do too to bad worth it. ignoring the Chronicle. Um, That's what true. I, what I did is I'm, I'm a game behind. Because the last time I played, um, one of the players was basically... I think he'd planned it from the start, but he knew what these were. Mm. Okay, he knew what the clans uh, did, and he basically went, oh yeah, I'm going to get this, and then I'm going to get this. So I've learned from that, and I kind of didn't bother much with this Chronicle, and I went, oh yeah, that, that worked last time. Now, you'll go on as the I say, last yeah. time, I, I still won the game last time by not doing this. I just, I kind of wanted to do it. So I looked at these earlier on this afternoon, and I thought, right, if I try and get some river tiles and some money then I will get these two. But then the way it worked out is I actually got this one and this one as well. So I got uh, I got 32 points from clans, which is where most yeah, of the yeah, you did. came you got from. A there. You did a really great job in the clan, uh, clan yeah. area. So I was happy with that. That's but... what's so fun about this game. There's like so many different strategies that mm -hmm. you can... There is, yeah. Uh, and that was obviously a three-player yeah. game. In a four-player game, you'd have an extra person fighting for the tiles. Yeah. Yeah. So... yeah. That is yeah. true. That's tough. <laughs> Three yeah, plays good. Well, at all, all player counts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we talked offline before the stream started that that this is the three-player game. With a two-player game, you're supposed to use a dummy player, which is basically a dice, which is uh, it's what one, 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 two, two, three. Yeah. Um, exactly. And you roll the dice to see how far the dummy player moves. It simulates a third player, and that's kind of needed for the two-player game because otherwise mm -hmm. it's a little bit too open. But optionally, mm -hmm. you could use it in the three-player game as well if you wanted to. It it simulates a fourth player, so the yeah, it speeds up the game. You will get fewer tiles each. Um, you know, there's no way that we're going to get twelve tiles each if we were playing with a dummy player as well. Um, but yeah, so are you, are you two right. doing a review of this game at all? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna do a playthrough. We're actually okay. uh, it's scheduled to go out next week. All <laughs> oh, right. Okay. Hopefully. So you're gonna yeah. do a playthrough and then what? Chat about it as part of that playthrough exactly. mm -hmm. yeah we do like a teach playthrough and then uh, a review at the end review at the end yeah yeah but overall mm -hmm. you're liking the game yeah oh, yeah. yeah every we time i play it really really yeah. like this game the first time we played it was at uh essen this past essen and uh naveen especially fell in love with it like immediately yeah. so yeah yeah very, i did have because uh, the game has been notoriously the first edition has been notoriously hard to get hold of and i had a german mm. copy of the oh, game I uh, and I, oh. I had it for years and it was in a little box 
and the production value was really not good but the game itself was was fantastic but then when i picked up this version i actually put my first edition version into a charity raffle so i i no longer own the first oh, edition right. of the game uh and it, it raised a bit of money for charity getting rid of it but yeah having now played the second oh, edition okay. and, and realizing all of the little rules tweaks from the first edition to the second edition yeah it, it is a big improvement but I'm, I'm going to be doing a review by the end of this month um i mean i'm tempted and i'm not going to have time but i would love to play through all of the chronicles before i do the review which means playing this game mm -hmm. another five times and then i'll have well, one yeah. crazy afternoon where we throw in all the chronicles and we play like a five hour game <laughs> with everything thrown in oh my gosh. <laughs> i'm not gonna have time to do that but um yeah this this is there's definitely other chronicles that i want to try out um yeah it's just it's just finding the time to do so yeah absolutely. right then it is 10 o'clock so it it was two hours that's not bad yeah, two hours yeah that's not bad that's not bad not at all. it would be quicker in person exactly i was just about yeah. to start. yeah yeah You've yeah got the, that's uh, part of the appeal of this game for me it's so quick yeah, yeah satisfying it's, but quick it's, it's yeah and somebody said earlier on that the the decisions that you have to make in this game every turn are crucial uh and they mm -hmm. are yeah so it's true yeah, yeah. cool well thank you very much yeah, to you two for joining cool. me that was a that Thanks was a blast for having thank you yeah, for having I'll, us I'll, we'll happily do this again if, if if you want to do it again and you can find a game that that you want to play at some point then just just give me a shout and let me know awesome thank you. absolutely well, what have you got thank planned you. for the rest thank of today you. Oh, pair, uh, well, he has a, a parents visiting from afar. We're yeah, still okay. like really socially distancing in California, right. so but so we haven't seen like our parents in a very long time. Right. Um, so his parents are coming by to say hi from across okay. the street. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're uh, gonna be in the same town. Yeah, cool. Uh, Vicky's mum came round this Wednesday. I'm not allowed to say this um, because if her sister ever finds out, she's she's gonna kill her. Um, uh, oh no. We we've got. Vicky, I, I had Vicky's dad's um, uh, jigsaw for cutting out wood and he needed it um, so mm -hmm. her mum came round now she came round she stood like you know five metres away dropped off the stuff that she was dropping off for us <laughs> we had a chat with her from miles away you know and then we left the box and she took it so it, it was totally safe um, yeah and Vicky hasn't seen her mum for weeks we we talk yeah. regularly oh, yeah. over you know we've got a facebook portal and we chat regularly over that and that's nice but they they've been missing each other seeing each other physically uh, however after yeah. she came around she said it was just weird it it kind of made her feel a bit scared because her mum was there with a with a face mask on uh, mm -hmm. and she's not sure whether she because i was saying well surely it must be nice to actually see her in the flesh and afterwards she was like no actually it was a little uncomfortable and i felt a bit scared and everything else it's weird how it's got mm -hmm. into our heads um, yeah, yeah there's, the, there's there. definitely yeah. a psycho psychology to it absolutely yeah yeah, yeah. So, cool it's well, gonna enjoy. take a while i think to undo that but... I, I think it will once all this is over the next time i go shopping when when this is all over you know in, in six months or a year's time and i go shopping and it's safe it's going to be weird because i kind of we're kind of used to the you know the two meter yeah. around having to walk around tesco as if it was ikea so if you miss the bananas on the way, tough. You know, you can't go back and get them. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, is that, yeah. is that how they do it over there? Well, that it, it's how they've done it, but lots of people are breaking those rules and like, oh, I forgot my bananas, I'll just go back. Whereas they've actually laid out a plan and you're supposed to follow it and oh, you're supposed wow. to stay two metres away. Okay. Not everybody does that, but, you know, they're, they're supposed to. Right. So anyway, enjoy the rest wow. of your day. I am going to be doing a live stream in, in about five or 10 minutes. If anybody's interested, I'm going to be playing through a pre-alpha version of the Tainted Grail Conquest digital game. I'm going to be doing that in about 10 minutes time um, once I've gone downstairs and got a drink. So yeah, if you're interested in that, uh, stick around on the channel. That will be coming live. And as mentioned at the start, uh, this video was purely funded through the support of my Patreon campaign. So if you enjoy the content I create uh, and you're able to support me, check out the Patreon page, patreon.com forward slash gaming rules. All ad revenue at the moment from YouTube is going to Black Lives Matter charity. So for everybody who's watching, thank you very much. All of your views is generating money for charity. Um, so yeah, thank you very much for watching. Take care of the both of you. I will speak to you uh, next time I see you. Bye, Paul. Thank Thanks. you. Cheers all. Thank you. Bye. Now. Bye.
Gaming Rules is proudly sponsored by Game Toppers, upgrading your gaming experience. Visit game